All right, this segment is sponsored by the Springfield Clinic. In studio today, we have Aaron Whalen, doctor from the Springfield Clinic. Today's topic is hearing loss, Doc. Thank you so much for yes. joining us today, Aaron. Thanks for having me. Yeah, so talk about it. What are some of the signs and symptoms that you may be going through this? So if you have any kind of ringing or noises in your ears, if you're turning the TV up, um, the volume louder than what's maybe comfortable for others, mm -hmm. um, sometimes you might feel like people are mumbling, um, asking people to repeat uh, more frequently, all of those are signs um, mm -hmm. of hearing loss. So is that an indication that maybe you should come in and get checked? Absolutely. So any of those um, signs, if you have those, it's a good idea to get your hearing checked. Also, if you feel like you're just missing out on conversation um, or if you're eyes isolating yourself socially because maybe you're missing out on um, conversation. Mm -hmm. um, those are all good indicators that it's time to get your hearing checked. And once they do come to you, what are some of the things that you guys do there as far as testing goes? And should people be alarmed sure. when they go there? <laughs> uh, no, no. So we offer comprehensive hearing tests for all ages. Um, so pediatrics all the way to geriatrics. Uh, we fit and dispense hearing aids. Um, and then we also offer custom noise and swim plugs. Oh, nice. Okay, awesome. And speaking of hearing aids, there's some new technologies. 2020, I'm sure things are kind of developing in your world of yeah. audiology, right? Absolutely. Um, so now we have rechargeable hearing aids. Um, so you put a hearing aid in the charger mm. um, and it uses a rechargeable battery. So after um, one charge, you get about 20 hours of wear time. Okay. Um, and then most recently, we al also have, um, you can stream phone calls, music, um, or podcasts from your smartphone directly through the hearing aids without the use of an extra device. It's like an ear pod. Yes, yeah, yeah, all <laughs> okay. through Bluetooth. So it's pretty wow. cool technology. Wow, and um, I wanna talk about younger people too. It's not necessarily, you think, you know, older people deal with this, but can you talk about younger patients as well and how they can be affected by hearing right. loss? Right, um, so, you know, young ones can have anything from ear infections to even permanent hearing loss. Mm. So um, they're, they're in a very important time of learning um, speech and, and school. So mm. it's very important for them to be able to hear. Yeah, stay up with all of this. Okay, Doc, and where can uh, they find you? Um, at the main campus, um, the West Building, fourth floor. Okay, sounds good. Thank you all so right. much, Dr. Thank you for being here today. And for Thanks. more interviews like this, our website will have it for you as well, foxillinois.com.